Hi, Leo. This is your reading for the time period of September 1st to September 14th, 2019. For those of you who are new to my channel, welcome and thank you for subscribing to Amani's Lightwork. Okay, so let's see what energies are coming through for you for September, Leo. All righty. I can't live here. So however, you know, whatever reason you're saying you can't live somewhere. So it could be an infestation. It could be annoying people. It could be, um, what do you call it? It could be like the, the, uh, the accommodations are off and it's not really working out for you. And you're like, I can't live here or whatever. This depends on what's going on there. It can even be connected to living with parents or grandparents and things of that nature. Three of Wands energy is underneath, but I get a Sag. So something maybe interesting maybe going on with a Sag and Aries and other Leo elements there, but I'm tired of doing business with them. So you're tired of doing business with the fire sign energies for some reason, they, but they take a lot of money or they don't use money well, or but that's why you can't find something. So when I said not, they don't use money well, you can't find something. So that could be the reason into why you can't find, I was getting, I can't live here so that could be the reason into why you're thinking that you can't find like a proper home or you, you can't find whatever whatever it is that you're saying that you can't find you, the fire sign energies are the reason into why you're saying that you can't find something properly or you can't find like this could be a situation here where you have a business deal with the fire sign energies but they may use a lot of money or but you they may use your cut of money also but for some reason them using your cut of money may take away from an ex, a very important expense that you have like a car or an apartment and things of that nature but i didn't know that was happening so you didn't know that someone was taking money you didn't know that someone was taking money out of i had shared business account like you you have a shared business account with the fire signs or like a family account but but they splurge so when i said family account and shared money and whatever it is that you you they may splurge on that money but the the, the percentage of that money that they splurge on is supposed to go to you it's supposed to go to your car payment it's supposed to go to your mortgage your 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 rent is supposed to go to that but are taking them to court also so the three of wands is that you you may need to take them to court. <laughs> For some reason, you may need to take business partners to court. Family members, you need to take them to court. I get sibling. You may need to take a sibling to court. For some reason, you need to take a sibling to court, but they take money. So the sibling, if it's a sibling, that a fire sign sibling, Aries or a Sag, whatever, fire sign sibling, that they they took they take money or they they don't use money well or something happened with money that you gave to them, they're not supposed to have money that you gave to them, they're not supposed to have. You you gave them okay the, you gave you you giving them money they're not supposed to have is like you, you're giving them money to give to someone else but they in, but instead of in, instead of giving the, instead of them giving the money to the person or the organization or, or the uh, the charitable event instead of them giving the money to that they're using it on themselves they're using it on themselves so let's see what's going on there okay. Starting point has the six of pentacles energy, but I need to share. So the six of pentacles is that you you may need to share with earth sign energy, but don't really want to. So you you may need to share with the earth signs, but you, you don't really want to share something with a Taurus. You, you but I like them. So sharing something with a Taurus, you like them, but it's a Virgo that you're annoyed by. So something's going on with a Virgo that you may be annoyed by for some reason. If it's a um if it's a Capricorn energy, but they left. A Capricorn energy may have left, but I want to see them again. So a Capricorn left you for some reason or they're not near you for some reason or they don't work where you work anymore like they left the situation I because of someone so or because of a Taurus or something that but Taurus intervened with something that they have going on so a Taurus is trying to intervene with something that Capricorn energy has going on but want them to come back so you and a Taurus or a Virgo not really a Virgo may not want a Capricorn energy back somewhere but you and a Taurus element you're you're trying to safeguard Capricorn you're trying to safeguard a Capricorn and you're trying to figure out ways to have them back somewhere in a business deal with you or or but Massage does 
does not want. So I said back in a business deal with you, a Sag does not want, Aries does not want, but they're jealous of. So Sag and Aries elements, they, they don't want a Capricorn energy back in their back in their business. They don't want them back at their workplace. They don't want them back in their office. They're jealous of. They're jealous of the Capricorn energy, but I like them. So you're saying that you like the Capricorn. Taurus likes Capricorn, but we're working together. So you're working together with a Taurus to figure out something with the Capricorn energy, but we like them. So you're saying that you and a Taurus like a Capricorn energy, but a Virgo doesn't. Sag and Aries are jealous of that element. What, but why? Why is a Sag and Aries jealous of a Capricorn energy with the Six of Pentacles energy being in the starting point? But they know a lot. So the jealousy is coming from the fact that the Capricorn energy knows a lot. That could be where the jealousy is coming from. And that could be why a Virgo doesn't like them. But some of them may be limited with the liking that a Virgo has with a Capricorn. But that that part, it could be something that you observe. But that's what a Taurus told you. So that part you observe that a Virgo has that kind of interaction with a Capricorn. But that's also what a Taurus may have related to you. That's what you converse with a Taurus element about often. But where is Capricorn? So conversing with a Taurus about often. Where is the Capricorn? Like you, the Six of Pentacles is that you want to invite them out. So Six of Pentacles is that you want to invite the Capricorn energy out. Taurus wants to invite them out, but they really like them. So when I said Taurus wanting to invite them out, they, they really like a Capricorn, but don't understand why also. So you may like a Capricorn, but but something is heavy about the Taurus liking them. The end. But you, you're like, you're, you're like, why? They really like them, but the, the really attached to that liking is extreme. The really attached to that liking is extreme. And you don't understand why. They like them heavily to that. You don't understand why they like them heavily to that point, but they're mystical. So it could have something to do with the fact that a Capricorn is mystical or the Taurus is mystical to get Capricorn back. A Taurus is utilizing something mystically to get a Capricorn energy back. The Aquarian helps them with that. So an Aquarian energy helps a Taurus with that. Does the Aquarian energy help you with something? I don't want to be involved with that though. So the Aquarian may have recommended you do something mystically, but we need all hands in. So the Aquarian energy recommended that you join in something mystically to help bring back somebody, to help bring back somebody to a workplace or an office or bring back an old lover, whatever it is like to the Taurus. They're, they're trying to do this, but it's mystical. But it's like you you need all hands in, like a seance. You, you we need all hands in. So something it's it's mystical. So it's like you you need a certain number of people, it could be six people. You need a certain number of people to stand in a circle to invoke something. You need whatever five point star stuff. <laughs> I don't know. Something something is witchcraft like about it, but into bringing somebody back somewhere or try to get a boss to change their mind so trying to get a boss to change their mind you want to but something but something needs to happen mystically in order for that to work but it's to fix a business deal so if it has nothing to fix somebody deems or you deem the fixing of a business deal to have to have it needs it needs a mystical person. It needs a mystical person. The Aquarian energy may be the mystical person or the Capricorn energy. We need them. We need the Capricorn energy, but somebody doesn't want them. Somebody may not want the Capricorn, but they're mystical. Somebody doesn't want the Capricorn somewhere because Capricorn is mystical. But you're saying that we need the Capricorn because they are mystical. We need the Capricorn because they're mystical or you just need the Capricorn energy period. But that's what an Aquarian sees. The, the Aquarian sees that you just, you need the Capricorn energy period, but we're full. So something's going on. A business may be full of business. A business may have the amount of people that it needs or, but the we're full is that a boss or supervisor may be telling you that we're full, but that's not true. So a, a, a place may be full, an office may be full, but that's not true. Bring them back. So bring the Capricorn back, bring, bring some somebody back. An Aquarian knows something about that also. So an Aquarian has secretive information into a, pay, a into office being not full, and, but somebody's saying that it is into like, a, um, into, you know, you know, when you apply for a job and they're, and they, and they, they respond by saying, you know, um, you know, we're, we're done, we're done with our hiring process. We already have the people that's, we already have the people, all the people that we need. That's not true. The Aquarian energy knows that that's not true, or the Taurus, you you know that that's not true, and that could be what's happening to the Capricorn energy. They're trying to bring them back. You're you're trying to figure out a way to bring them back. If it's not anything like that, the Six of Pentacles is that you you're just spending time with the Tauruses. You're just spending time with the Capricorns, but they talk a lot. So spending time with the Earth signs, they talk a lot. Or you think somebody's gonna talk about themselves the whole entire time, like Capricorn male. So you think a Capricorn male is gonna talk about themselves the whole entire time? The 
female may be that way too, but not that much. The female may be that way too, but not that much. It's Capricorn male that talks about themselves all the time, but they may be egotistical. So a Capricorn male may be egotistical. Do you deem a Capricorn female to be egotistical? It just, it just depends on what's going on there, okay? Or somebody deems you to be this way, or you're, you're trying to be however you want. You want however you want. To look at bring them back. Like bring them back is like you you want to see them again. You it doesn't have to be work. You you want to be with them again, or you you want to be with them again, or you want you haven't seen someone in a while. You want to see them again. It just depends on what's going on. But you're trying to do either you're trying to do something mystically to bring them back, or you or or you have trying to have a come with an Aquarian. You're just trying to have a conversation with an Aquarian on how to bring them back or how to see them, how to invite them over, things of that nature. Okay. Uh the waiting position has the judgment card, but what you're doing. So judgment energy is what you're doing with the six of pentacles energy. There is judgment. Okay. Why do they care? So the judgment energy on what you're doing is, is why, why does somebody care? Why, why does a boss or a supervisor care about what you're doing? Why, why does a, um, what do you call it? Why does a, uh, why does, who else is there? The, why does the Sag and the Aries element care, but differing? So why does the Sag and the, why does the Sag and the Aries care? Someone's going with, with, with differing with them. So they have a differing, something is differing with the other fire sign energies. Something differs with them for some reason. Like they, they have a different perspective into something or they have a different mind. They just have a different mindset from you or a different business object. They have a different business objective than you do, but I'm tired of that. So they, the fire sign energies having different business objectives from you, you're tired of that. That could be why you want the earth sign energies back. Like it now, that could be why you want the earth sign energies back now, because the fire sign energies they, they may try they, they may be controlling the other fire signs. They may be controlling or trying to mind control you. Their their controlling is mind controlling you. That's that's why the judgment energy is there. That they, they're controlling maybe mind controlling you and I get leaving a business deal also. So the six of pentacles with the judgment is that they something something may be okay something something may be mystical about it or not something may be mind controlling. In into a decision that a supervisor, but I'm aware of that. Something maybe mind con may have been mind controlling, literally, like mystically. So something may have been mind controlling about a decision that a supervisor or a boss made. Something literally, somebody literally did like an incantation or I Aquarius. And Aquarius literally did an incantation or some. So either, but the, it's the reason to why the Capricorn isn't somewhere, but they did something mystically. The reason to why the Capricorn is not somewhere is because the Aries, the Sag, the, the Aquarius, somebody utilized something mystically. They utilize something mystically to mind control a supervisor or a boss into making a clear and cut decision. They mind control a boss or a supervisor into making a decision. And the decision either either is either is to bring somebody back, like the the mystical and the mind controlling and things of that nature. Either either is to bring somebody back somewhere or is to get them out of a business. But I observed that. So when I say get them out of a business, you observe that something was something was mystical there. With the judgment energy being in the waiting position, but I was a part of that. So you you may have been a part of that, you know. That's why I said five point star and and and, and mystical and circles and, and and incantations and things of that nature. But you you could have been a part of that. It doesn't have to be that. You could have been a part of that. Just an example. Not every business does that, but but something is mystical about that. But you could have been a part of receiving a, a secret. It could just be a conversation. You could have been a part of that as well, but you made a mistake. So you being a part of that as well, you made a mistake. That's why the judgment energy is there. You may have made a really bad mistake with joining in hands with uh, joining in hands with people who betray the earth sign energies. But I want the Taurus. So you you want the Taurus, but the Capricorn energy. Something was mystical. Somebody did something mystically to. Get the Capricorn energy out of a place, out of a home, out of a workplace. The Sag and Aries elements, they, they're responsible, they're jealous of. The Sag and Aries element, they're responsible for that, but it's because they're jealous of the, of that element. And the Taurus has something that's mystical. The Taurus has information that something is mystical there. That's why the, ju the judgment energy being in the way... The judgment energy being in a waiting position is because the mystical part of that is what's coming out, but I'm embarrassed. So you may be embarrassed by that for some reason because the Capricorn knows that, but because of a Taurus, the Capricorn knows that. So the Capricorn may know that because of a Taurus. It could have been it could have been something that they heard a Taurus saying all the time, or but scheming. So the they could have heard the Taurus talking about scheming all the time. Or, or how people are schemed, or but it's mystical. The way people are schemed out of a business. 
it's mystical. Like somebody, so people, people literally get in circles and they, or they chant or do something or they recite something, but it somehow it taps into somebody's subconscious mind to get them to make a decision. Somehow it taps into somebody's subconscious. This could be a situation here where a boss or supervisor was really close to a boss or supervisor is really close to keeping or sign energy somewhere, or they were really they, whatever they were really close to keeping them somewhere. But I did something when I said that you did something. You you did something mystically. You may have done something mystically, but Gemini knows that. So a Gemini energy knows that you did something mystically. Did a Gemini energy do something mystically so a Capricorn won't be somewhere? A Gemini energy did something mystically so a Capricorn won't be somewhere. So the Capricorn energy and a Taurus has information, but they're embarrassed. The Taurus having information on that, they're embarrassed. Like you're embarrassed or not really. So you may not really be embarrassed, but a Taurus and Sag and Aries, they don't care. A Taurus and Sag and Aries may not care or a Sag and Aries element badly embarrassed. The Sag and Aries element are badly embarrassed. Like something is extreme about their embarrassment because they utilize something mystically. Something is extreme with their embarrassment because they utilize something mystically to, to, to get somebody out, to get somebody in, to, to get someone to make a decision, an unconscious one, to leave or stay somewhere with, with the judgment and or a Gemini energy did that to a Capricorn. Right? So they won't get hired somewhere. The Gemini energy did that so a Capricorn won't get hired somewhere. They won't get hired somewhere. So, so that, uh, or, or if somebody's already in the job, somebody did something mislead to get someone to leave, but somebody feels bad. So they're trying to get some. They're trying to reverse the mysticism. <laughs> they're trying to reverse the mysticism and, and fix it. But we, we actually really need them. How can we do something mystically to bring them back? You know. How are we going to do something mystically to bring them back? Or what kind of conversation are we going to need to have to bring them back? I keep getting it's mystical, but but something there is mystical. So so either someone is mystical and that's why they that's why they're not somewhere anymore. Or somebody, somebody, I get scared of them also. So someone may be scared of the earth sign. There's that. But I'm not. So the other elements that I ran through, they may be scared of the of the Capricorn. They're scared of the other earth sign, but you're not scared of them for some reason. You may not be scared of them, but but you but you you not being scared of them I have to do something. You you not being scared of them. It just me it just means that you you were asked to do something mystically or join in on something mystically. It just depends on what's going on. You know, you may be trying to safeguard a Gemini energy's business and things of that nature, but they don't care. So trying to safeguard a Gemini energy's business, they don't care. They don't care, but they, they, they may constantly utilize some of the mystically to protect their own business, but thinks that Capricorn is going to triumph over them. They, they think a Capricorn energy is going to triumph over them. It's annoying them, though. So it's annoying the Capricorn energy with the judgment energy being in a way. But I know that they do that. Judgment energy is that you know that somebody utilize, utilizes something mystically to, I, to keep themselves above somebody else. So they utilize something mystically to keep themselves above someone. Or stop someone from being hired from stop stop someone from being hired hired somewhere to to stop someone from be, becoming a part of their business deal or from from their own from the Gemini energies boss I get Libra when I said that from stopping a Libra from liking one of the Earth sign energies you're aware a Gemini energy uses something mystically there to stop to stop that kind of liking but what's wrong with them so when the Gemini utilizes something mystically to stop that liking what's wrong with the Gemini? What's wrong with a Gemini? Like, so there's something maybe going on neurologically with a Gemini that that could be why they do something, but they're insecure. So they they're insecure and they they're competitive and possessive, and that could be why they utilize something mystically over someone all the time. But I want to leave. So you could be tied to the Gemini and you want to leave them because of that exact reason. All right. If it's not that the judgment energy is is a coworker is finding out why they're not somewhere. Judgment energy is a coworker or sign coworker is finding out why they're not somewhere. Somebody utilizing something missing to get them out of somewhere, or or something's going on with witchcrafty like things I, in a business. Something's going on with witchcrafty like stuff in a business, in a business deal, in a family business deal. Not wanting certain people involved in that. And at Aries, the Aries may have done something mystically there. Or the Gemini energy did something mystically told that Libra, that's their boss or their friend or their lover, won't look at a Capricorn. But a Taurus is also tied to a Libra. The Taurus is also tied to a Libra. And the Libra may be looking at Capricorn. The Libra observes that a Taurus is looking at a Capricorn energy. But it's annoying them. So it's annoying the Libra. 
that that's happening. One Libra, that it's annoying of uh, that Libra. It's the Gemini's tied to. The, it's annoying the Gemini that uh, uh, a Libra that they're tied to is looking at a cap constantly. A Libra that they're tied to is looking at a Capricorn energy constantly. It's annoying the Sag and the Aries are taking care of Capricorn. It's annoying to the Sag and the Aries because they feel like they need to take care of a Capricorn energy. So they're utilizing something mystically to get somebody back in their job. <laughs> they're utilizing something mystically to get them out of a job. But I keep getting jealous of. They're something that they're doing something that they're they're doing constantly it is implying that they're jealous of somebody but mysticism is tied into that so the gemini has that kind of jealousy going on or or you think that they do that's why you want to leave them or or, or a libra or something's going on with a, a female something's going on with a libra female that a taurus is tied to or you're tied to and they're jealous and they're jealous of somebody or the Sagittarius, somebody's jealous of them. They keep utilizing something. They keep utilizing something mystically, and it's interfering with somebody's life path. With the judgment energy being in the waiting position, but leave them alone. So the judgment energy is you're telling the Gemini, leave the Earth sign energy alone. You're telling the Sagittarius, leave them alone. Why are they utilize? Why are they utilizing something mystically? So you don't even understand why the Sag, the Aries, the uh, the uh, the Gemini. You don't understand why they utilize something mystically on the Earth sign. Why do they keep doing that? It's interfering with somebody's life path for some reason, or something's going on with um. Something's going on with conversations and things of that nature that you may have had with Sag and Aries. Conversations that you had or had to have with a Sag and Aries element, you know? Conversations that you have, but stop doing something. So you're trying to tell them to stop doing something. You're having conversations with the Gemini, stop doing something. Having conversations with the fire signs, stop doing something. But they're not going to listen. So they may not be listening, but knew, knew someone was going to lose their job. So they knew someone was going to lose their job. That's why the judgment energy is in a way. They knew something, they knew someone was going to lose their job. An Aquarian could have gave you that heads up because of a Taurus. An Aquarian gave you that heads up because of a Taurus. But but something is mystical, like that the fire sign energies did, the Gemini did, something was mystical, or the Aquarian did. Something was mystical about that. And but trying to act like they had nothing to do with it. So they were trying to act like they had nothing to do with it, mystically or not mystically, or they they interjected into a conversation, they 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 chimed in on a conversation about somebody and they're trying to act like they did not chime in on a conversation about somebody you know jeez uh the present has a chariot sign of cancer but need to travel too so you, you may need to go find a cancer you know or if, if it's not the sign of cancer then you need to travel you're, you're the chariot energy is traveling period by a deception so you, you're trying to get away from deception or a, de a deceptive business deal or a deceptive business that's why I said wanting to leave or wanting to leave the Gemini or wanting to leave the Sag, the Aries, the Aquarius, but they betrayed. So all of those elements betrayed someone or or that could be why you want to spend time with the Earth signs because they were betrayed. But I don't really want to do that. So spending time, you do or you do not want to spend time with the Earth sign energies or the Aquarian energy could have asked you to spend time with them or distract them. Or you're trying to find a cancer to keep Earth sign energy distracted, but don't know where they are. So you may not know what a, where a Cancerian energy is for some reason. You don't know where a Cancerian energy, but Capricorn can't find. So a Capricorn energy cannot find a Cancer, or you yourself can't find a Cancer. This depends on what's going. But they disappeared. A Cancerian energy may have disappeared. The judgment energy being in, in your waiting position is that you the the judgment energy in the waiting position is that you the, with the Six of Pentacles is that you you may have wanted to give back money to the Cancer. You may want you may have wanted to give money back to a Cancer, but they're involved with a business deal. They are involved with a business deal that's going on here. You the, the giving them back money could be money. Okay, I see what's going on. The giving them back money could literally be money that was supposed to go to a coworker that that left. There's that money, money that was supposed to go to a coworker that was schemed out mystically or money that was supposed to go to a coworker that left or they left intentionally or whatever they left, whatever it is money that was supposed to go to another business partner that they end up leaving. But some is mystical about the reason into why they left. So that money may be going to a cancer, but you can't find them for, because of that. You can't find them for because of that exact reason. You can't find a cancer because of that exact, they don't want the money. The cancer may not want the money, but they, they, the reason for that is that like the reason for that, but deems, deems them, they deems themselves to be a betrayer. So they deem themselves to be a part of your betraying group that you have with them. They, they deem themselves to be a betrayer. 
they deem themselves to be a betrayer. So they, they don't want to take, they do not want to take a cut of money that was supposed to that schemed out. They don't want to take a cut of money that, that was supposed to go to someone that, that, that got schemed out there with the chariot energy being in the present, but they may not care also. So they, they don't, there's an element there. There's an element here where they, they don't care. But there's an element about this where they don't care, but at the same time, they kept because they, that's why they're extracting. At the same time, they care, but that could be why they're going missing. The, the going missing it implies that they're extracted from a business deal, a, a family business deal, family money, and things of that nature. That that's what's that's what's going on there with the judgment energy in the waiting position. But I'm embarrassed. Judgment energy is I'm embarrassed. Because somebody knows some family money. Somebody knows about secretive business deals and, and scheming and the family scheming and money and, and, and businesses and taking certain people out, bringing certain people in. That's the scheme or that's the tactic. Bringing certain people out, bringing certain people in. That's the scheme. That's the tactic. And a cancer knows that, or they, they want to be extracted from that. That could be why they don't talk to certain family members and coworkers and business partners. That could be why the cancer is extracted in that way, but need to find them. So you really need to find the cancer. You really need to find them. But but you if you if you end up finding them, they're not going to take money that you're trying to give them. If you end up finding them, they're not going to take it because they to an extent, to an extent, they themselves may also feel betrayed. They were once also schemed as well. They at one point were also schemed. And that could be why that could but you you may want them, but they themselves may have also been schemed. But but at the same time, if, if they were schemed, they may have remorse for someone else that was schemed. So they're not going to take money. <laughs> they're not going to take they may have been schemed. So they're they they're not going to take money from someone that was also schemed. Why don't you want to take the money? So you're you're trying to figure out why if you if you're managing to get in contact from if you're managing to get in contact with them, you're asking them, why don't you want to take the money? I don't, I'm not listening. So they're, they're trying to tell you, I'm not, I'm not listening, or I, I don't want to talk to you, cutting off phones. So they're trying to cut off phones and, and, and cut lines and, and try to act like they're static on the phone and things of that nature because of a business deal. They're trying to act like they're static and things of that nature on the phone because they don't want to be involved in a shady business deal anymore. In a family or in a workplace, it just depends on what's going on. But I was going to give you a lot of money or they were going to give you a lot of money. You're trying to tell them that they were going to receive a lot of money. You know, this could be a situation here where in a business, like a, a business may be trying to cut back on certain payments or pay certain people a certain amount of money. But something's going on where that you're trying to tell them that they may end up getting paid more because somebody's leaving or somebody's not coming back. So you're trying to tell them that they're, they, they're potentially they will end up being paid, but they don't care. Potentially they'll end up getting paid more, but they don't care. They don't care because they're annoyed with scheming. They're annoyed by the way people are being schemed. They're annoyed by it, but but they know something is mystical that's what's annoying them. They also know, or some part of this, they also know that something is also mystical and that could also be what's annoying them, okay? Whew. If it's not anything with cancer and things of that nature, the judgment energy with the chariot is just, you, you apologize to, you're just traveling to apologize to the earth signs you feel the need to apologize, but Aries does not want you to do that. So Aries element may not want you to travel to apologize to the earth signs or the cancer. Or they feel betrayed. The cancer feels betrayed. Or sign feel betrayed, you know? And you want to invite them out and spend time with them because they were schemed. You want to invite them out and spend time with them because you're aware that they were schemed, mystically or not mystically. The future has the eight of swords energy there, okay? The instincts has the king of pentacles energy, like I said, that could be a Taurus, other earth sign energies that are males. All of them know something. So Capricorn male, Virgo male, Taurus male, they all know something there. They all know something. That's why the six of pentacles energy is there, but they're not helpful. So six of pentacles energy, these earth sign males may not be helpful, but they're somewhere still. So the earth sign, because they're light, the earth sign males are somewhere still because they're light, like light. L I K E D, but they're just light, you know. There, that could be where the judgment energy is coming from. They're just light. That could be why they're somewhere for so long. Mm. That could be why they're somewhere for so long in a family, or that could be why they receive money over someone else. It just, it's the females. So when I say them, just them just receiving money over someone else, it, that it's just the females that that strangeness may be happening to. Cancer has remorse. A cancer has remorse for the females. 
The Cancerian energy has remorse for the Ursine females, not the Ursine males, because they're privileged. The Cancer doesn't have remorse for the Ursine energies that are males because they're privileged. Cancer doesn't have remorse for them, but they receive a part of someone's money also. The Ursine males, all of them, they receive a part of somebody's money also. And it could be the Ursine energies, it could be Ursine females that they receive part. But they it's oh, the reason into that is because this is like Ursine females, they're not somewhere anymore. Hence the reason somebody doesn't need to pay them anymore. So that's extra money, that's surplus. That's that's extra money that could potentially go to these Ursine males. They're happy about that. They, it could potentially go to these Ursine males and these Ursine males are really happy about that. But but somebody behind the scenes has remorse. Someone behind the scenes has remorse for that. That you know that that they know that somebody has remorse for that. That's coming to somebody's attention. I had discussed it. So that is coming to somebody's attention or somebody's attention, and they're becoming disgusted by that. It feels like they want to utilize something mystically. So you may be thinking, I you think the King of Pentacles energies utilize something mystically? I have to safeguard their spot. They you they may utilize something mystically to safeguard their spot in, in a business deal. They they safeguard themselves mystically somehow. Gemini knows that. So a Gemini energy knows they safeguard themselves mystically. They do what they did not, or they just safeguard themselves by, by applying for something every year. But but I keep getting utilized something mystically. They utilize something mystically all the time to safeguard themselves, and they won't end up in a, as the females. So they won't end up in a, in, a, in a situation that the assigned females ended up in. You know, but something maybe mystical about one one or however many of the earth sign energies of females that, that are females also, but they still got schemed out. For, people don't like them. They still got schemed out anyway because people don't like them. But the reason for the not liking them is, is jealousy. It's jealousy from, from the Sag and the Aries and, and the Gemini and, and whatever it is that's going on, but not really. So when I hit Gemini, they're not really jealous of the earth sign females. You know, but only Capricorn. The Gemini energy may be jealous of a Capricorn female. You know, or they may not have that feeling with a Taurus female. They may not have that feeling. They may not have that feeling with a Virgo female. That could be what they literally. That could literally be what a Gemini energy said, or a or a Cancer said. But has remorse for the females. A Cancer has remorse for the Earth sign females. But the Ursine males triumph over. The Ursine males are triumphing over because they, they're they receiving something that belongs to the Ursine females. It just depends. But why do they like the guys? So why, why does why does the supervisor like the like the guys so much in the workplace? Why does a boss or supervisor like the guys? But that's what a Gemini said. A Gemini energy intuitively they know or just know that, that the guys in a workplace are liked more than the females for some reason. It's jealousy. It's because this is like a boss or supervisor is jealous of females in a workplace, but they, they don't have that feeling because they're males. They don't have that feeling with the males because they're, because they're males. Like someone isn't jealous of males in a workplace because they're males. And you have that information. And Gemini has that information that, that can be why they can't left that's why the cancer left because they're annoyed by that observation they're just annoyed by that observation you know but trying to safeguard their spot so they may have tried to safeguard their spot but left intentionally so they left intentionally but they can't stand the favoritism that the assigned males are particularly Taurus they can't stand the favoritism that a Taurus is receiving by a boss or supervisor Whatever they or a fa another family member, they can't stand the favoritism that they're receiving for some reason. They can't stand it. By the fire signs, the Aries, the Sag, whatever. The Nine of Pentacles energy is right next to the Six of Pentacles energy. But I need to save the Nine of Pentacles that you 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 may need to save money, but it's their money. So you needing to save money, it's the Earth sign energy's money. It's the earth sign energy's money that you that you're saying that you need to save. So so either either you feel the need, I feel bad. You feel the need to save part of their money for them. You feel the need to save part of their money, but using it on them. So you you your money that belongs to the earth sign energy it could be family will money. It could be family money. It could be money that money that could have belonged to them if they didn't leave a workplace or they weren't asked to leave a workplace or they left intentionally or whatever. But money that belonged to them, you you money that could 
money that could have belonged to them. You took a part of the access supervisor. You took a, you asked a supervisor if you could take part of that money that did belong to the earth sign females or, or, or sign male, whatever. You told them, but they asked you to do that. They, they may have asked you to take part of that money, but saving it for them. So you're trying to save it for the earth signs, but the saving it for the, has you have remorse. The save, saving part of it for them is that you have remorse. You have some is remorse, like you you have remorse there. So you, you may want, but the spirit was also like you're you're also trying to use it on them by by buying them groceries, by by taking them out, but you're trying to treat them to their own money. You're trying to treat them to their own money. That's what it's looking like. You're trying, but cancer thinks that's crazy. So a cancer thinks that you treating the earth sign energies to their own money is crazy. But a boss or supervisor, a boss or supervisor asks you to do that. You're telling the cancer, a boss or supervisor, a, a cousin, a, a, a mom or dad, a family member, somebody asks you to do that. But the cancer thinks that that's crazy. You know, cancer thinks something foolish. A cancer thinks something is foolish about that for some reason. Just give them their money. So the cancer is like, just give the earth sign energy their money, not the males. The, the earth sign males receive whatever it is that they receive openly right, from Aries. They they receive whatever openly from an Aries element. But the female short change, the females may be getting short, the earth sign females may be getting short change. And the cancer, whoever is giving you the money to hold for them, the cancer thinks it's foolish, and the cancer is like just give them their just give them their damn money. It could be will money that belongs to someone Capricorn. It's will money that belongs to a Capricorn. It's 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 part of their paycheck that they would have had if they were in a workplace that you were asked to hold. It's it's their paycheck money that they that they would have had if they stayed somewhere. It's pay, their paycheck money that you were asked to hold. And somebody thinks something is foolish because you're not because you you're not giving somebody their money back for some or you're or you're treating them to their own money. But that's foolish. Treating them, treating somebody to their own money is foolish. That sounds foolish. Like a, that's what a Taurus observes. So that could be what a Taurus male observes. But why don't they take the reins then? So why doesn't a Taurus male take the reins if, if they don't like how a supervisor, if they don't like the rundown a supervisor gave you with somebody else's money, if, if they don't like that, why aren't they for somebody that, that they love? Why aren't they taking the reins for someone that they love? You think that a tourist needs to do that. They need to jump in and say something, protect someone that they love. They need to protect someone that they love. The Capricorn could be someone that they love. One of those earth sign females could be someone that they love. They're being shortchanged. Earth sign females are being shortchanged. And you may be, you deep down inside, you, you really don't want to hold somebody's money. But you deep down inside, you're, you're annoyed by that kind of treatment. But I need to stop. You're, you, you yourself are annoyed by that kind of treatment. And you, you need to stop. The judgment energy is like, you need to stop. You know, you may need to stop there. You know what I mean? Or the cancer has that view of you because of what you're involved in. Or the cancer has that view of you in a workplace with, with what the supervisor asks you to do. What what another family member, Aries and Sag, business partners and, and whatever, what they ask you to do, foolishness. They ask you to do foolishness. They may have asked you to do foolishness there, okay? The spiritual self has the wheel of fortune right next to the judgment card. You, I, I need to leave. So the chariot with the judgment card and the wheel of fortune, you, you may need to leave a workplace, you know, because of what someone is finding out. So you may need to leave a workplace because of what someone is finding out, what a cancer is finding out, what are assigned males are finding out, but they're protected. The assigned males are protected in a workplace. Boss or supervisor protects them hungrily. They, they're obsessed with them or something. Whatever, it's weird. But they, they protect them. But they, they may not really protect the earth sign females. But but they're finding out something. The wheel of fortune next to the judgment with the chariot is the earth sign females are finding out. I'm embarrassed. The earth sign females are finding out something. That, hence the reason for the embarrassment. Hence the reason for the embarrassment. That's why the wheel of fortune is in the spiritual self. You know, the wheel of fortune, I need to take a vacation. Nine of Pentacles, wheel of fortune, I need to take a vacation. Want to take the earth sign females with you or or you want to do this with the earth sign females and the Taurus? You want to do this with the earth sign females and the Taurus there. Or they particularly Capricorn, they want Capricorn male, female, particularly the Taurus may want them to come, not the Virgo. They don't want a Virgo to come somewhere. They don't want a Virgo female to come somewhere. They want a Capricorn male and female. I want. You want a Capricorn male and female to join you somewhere. But the, the, the treating someone to their money, it's their money. The treating someone to their money, it's their money. It's a Capricorn male and female energy's money. Hmm. 
you know? But the Capricorn male may receive more than the Capricorn female, or the Taurus makes more than the Capricorn male, or the Taurus makes more than the Capricorn female, but I have that money. You, you have that money for some reason, or the Taurus gave you that money to hold. That's why the Wheel of Fortune energy is in, in the spiritual self there, you know? Hmm. Oh. Whew. The mentality has the fire want arguing with fire signs, obviously. That <laughs> you feel like you need to argue with the other fire sign energies, with and with fire wands energy being in the mentality. Why are you arguing with them? So why are you arguing with the fire sign? If you're not arguing with the fire sign energies, then it could be the can pentacles energy. They have somebody's money. You you feel like you need to argue with them because they have somebody's money, but a boss or supervisor gave them that money, but they use it on themselves. They a boss or supervisor, somebody let Somebody that left the workplace, a boss or supervisor gave Taurus. A boss or supervisor gave the Taurus cut a cut of that money, and they they may uh, they may use that on themselves. They may use that on themselves. That's that could be why the arguing with them about taking the reins, they don't care. The arguing with them about taking the reins for someone, they may not care. Or the fact that you're asking them to do that, they may not care. So it just depends on what's going on. But do I need to take the reins? The five of wands is do I need to take the reins in this business deal? Do, do I need to take the reins in this office, in this workplace? Do I need to take the reins here? Because I don't like what I see. But that's what a cancer said. So the, a cancer is observing in his family, whatever. A cancer is observing that you, you may need to take the for a Taurus. You need to take the reins for a Taurus because they're going out of control with someone else's money. They're going out of control with someone else's money. And someone is stupid about that for some reason. Well, the five of wands and the king of pentacles energy there. But arguing the fire signs about them. You're arguing to the fire sign energies about the Taurus male. About what they did about somebody's money they have, but they care about somebody. So the Taurus does care about somebody, but they they may not be as they may not be as headstrong as you are with with they may not be as headstrong as you are with with giving somebody their money back. You know, or they don't care or something. You think they don't care. And that's why the five of wands is in the mentality. You're thinking you're and I'm arguing with them over that. You know? Hmm. This depends on what's going on. What's changing is a seven of swords energy. So making plans. So your plans are changing because of a Taurus. Your plans are changing because of a Taurus, but thinks they need to jump in. You heavily think that they need to jump in. Like it's time. Like it's time. It's right next to the wheel of fortune because I need to leave and take a vacation. They need to take the reins. You want them to take the reins, but they're not. What the hell do I need to do? Do I need to get mystical? For, do I need to get mystical for a Taurus to take the reins? I can get it for someone that they love. Do I need to get mystical for a Taurus to take the reins for someone that they love? That could be what a Gemini and a Cancer observe. Or that's what they constantly talk about together or by themselves. But they don't really care also. So a Gemini and a Cancer may not really care also. They may not really care also for some reason, but Aries and Sag are annoying. So I'm looking at the five of wands. The Aries and the Sag elements are annoying. They're annoying for some reason, you know? They're just annoying. The, the, the reason into why they're annoying is because they, they give somebody, the, the, somebody that left the workplace, they give it a clown. They gave, they gave the money to a clown. Somebody in the family, the, somebody in the family is a clown. They, they gave the money to a clown or whoever they deem to be a clown. <laughs> they deem somebody to be a clown for some reason there. The resolution has the eight of cups energy going towards the eight of swords, uh, uncomfortable. So the eight of swords energy and the resolution going towards the eight of swords, you feel really uncomfortable for some reason. It's cups energy also, but you feel uncomfortable what a cancer said. You feel uncomfortable what a cancer said. Pisces, what the water, all of them, what all the water sign energy said, your morals. So the if water sign energy chimed in on your morals <laughs> or some of you have earth sign energy money or you hold an earth sign energy money but the females every time i say earth sign energy money the females you hold it on to their money you have their money for whatever reason you have their money but it's other fire sign energies that it's the reason into why you have their money you know and the spirit is like stop giving them money back you know, some of them would be better. Some of them would be better in your job or your workplace or in your own life if you just give somebody their money back. But I was asked to hold. Some of them will be better for you in life, but you, somebody asks you to hold that money for some reason. But you don't really want karma. You you may not really want to do that because of karma, and that's what a Gemini and a Cancer see. But at the same time, they don't really care. You know, the Cancer has remorse, but they're extracted. The Cancer has remorse, but they're extracted for that exact reason. For that exact reason, they're extracted there, okay? It is Swords energy being in the future, 
you know? But I need a call. The eight of swords is I, I need a call. It's air sign element. I, I need to call a Gemini. I need to call Aquarian. But they're mystical. The Gemini and the Aquarian are mystical. You need to call them. Fix this. Have them come back. Bring them back to our family. Bring them bring them back to this workplace. Do whatever you need to do. Get however you need to get mystical. Can you fix this? You know, can you fix this? It, it's making you uncomfortable. Karma. The idea of karma is making you really uncomfortable for some reason. Or the fact that someone, the fact that someone in the family is mystical that was taken from. The fact that someone in the family that is mystical, but they were took, they were taken from is making you nervous. Because somebody's becoming more powerful. It's because someone is becoming more pow powerful. And it could be one of the earth sign females. All right? In a workplace. Or somebody has that kind of power going on. And, and that could be what's scary or something. All right? Or somebody, or the Aquarian or Gemini, they're mystical. And you want them to fix something, but they don't. Because deep down the side, they may be envious and jealous of somebody. In addition to the Sag and the Aries, and they cause somebody to want to leave, or they did something mystically to get somebody out of the job. Or why would they do that? They complain about somebody all the time. Why do you lie to something mystically to interfere with someone like that? If they keep complaining about them, but they did something mystically to cause them to get out of a job, whatever. But it doesn't make any sense though. Or they had they actually, or they had a conversation with somebody's supervisor. The fireside entities may have had a conversation with somebody's supervisor. Your supervisor, somebody's supervisor, they just had a conversation. If it's not mystical, but someone was heavily mystical about that also, all right? Let's see what the outcome is here, Leo. Or you think somebody needs to jump in, the, 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 the Taurus needs to jump in for someone that they love, and it could be the Capricorn or the Virgo, female energies. The males are being favored in a family. You don't understand. When I said the males being favored in a family and workplace business deal, you don't understand. You may not understand. The pay to swords energy is in the outcome, right? Pay to swords energy research. Pay to swords energy could be research or how to get a coworker back. How it's pay to swords. It could be air sign elements. You know, doing research. I incantation. You're trying to do research on an incantation. You're trying to research incantations. Or spells or some of this witchy like going on here. So you're trying to you're trying to do research on that stuff, you know, to save something, to not save something, to get a Taurus to move also, to, to get a Taurus to make moves for someone that they love, or just to get them to make moves, period. Stop someone from doing something, or to get somebody rehired somewhere, you know, but it's going to work. To get somebody rehired somewhere, it's going to work. But it has something to do with an incantation that you're trying to research. <laughs> or or if it's not an incantation you're trying to research, you you're just trying to look, you're the doing research is doing research is a functionality. Doing research is that you're just trying to do research on how somebody could be more functional in the workplace or how a particular business partner can get their job back. How a particular business partner can get their job back. But somehow for some reason it involves doing research for some reason. But it's mystical. So something is mystical about the research. So it's an incantation or it's a, uh, what do you call it? Or it's something that somebody has to sign, but it's mystical. Or or some type of initiation-like stuff is going on there. That could be what you, Capcorn. That could be what you need to do with the Capcorn. Someone, someone may not be initiated into something. And that could be why something is happening to them all the time that's interesting. You know, because someone is not initiated into something. But other elements, other other people in the family and the workplace are, but that's the secret. So other people in the family and workplace are there. Someone's going with being initiated into something, but somebody, some some something that is happening to someone interesting all the time, they may not be initiated, but they they masonry. So someone someone may need to be initiated into masonry. And it could be, it could be the king of pentacles energies. Or, or they are already, or it's the earth science females that need to be in a workplace or in a job. I mean, in or in a family environment. Like someone needs to be initiated in order to receive money. Someone needs to be initiated in order to receive money, but it's mystical, all right? But masonry is tied into that there. Like family bloodline masonry is tied into that, okay? One part of that, or, or you're just doing, it doesn't have to be masonry. So however you wanna look at initiation, Somebody, somebody needs to have something like that done 
however you want to look at the word initiation. So, so either it's either, either it's heavy and masonry is involved, <laughs> either it's heavy and masonry in a family or workplace, either it's heavy and masonry is involved there. Masonry is involved, or it's just um, or it's just somebody needs to what do you call it? Just, just research on functionality and things of that nature, how to make a business better without certain people. Because certain people were, were are not somewhere because of jealousy, and they may have been let go. They weren't let go. But you're trying to research to see how you can, how you could have a business be functional with with or without them, or additions and things of that nature, or someone's going on with incantations to bring somebody back, get someone to leave, or 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 someone's going on with initiations. They need to be. So when I say initiations, they whoever the they is, they need to be or sign Capricorn females, whatever. Somebody needs to be. Cancer needs to be. That could be why they're extracted. They may not. They may not want to be a part of that, or they, they don't want to be a part of what that entails. Something may entail something really interesting that you have to do. <laughs> it just depends on what's going on. Or something that you have to listen to, whatever. Something's interesting about that. All right, all right. Let me know how it resonates, Leo. Be well. Take care. Bye.